Father in heaven, we worship you this morning. We glorify your name, Lord. We magnify your mighty power. You are great and greatly to be praised. You are El Giboa. You are the mighty man of war, the mighty warrior who has never lost a battle. We glorify your name. Oh, El Elyon, possessor of the heavens and the earth. We glorify your name. Yahweh Saboeth, the commander in chief of angelic armies. We worship you this morning. Elohim, the source of our life, the source of every living thing. You are our creator. You are almighty, all powerful, all wise, all knowing. And we glorify your name this morning. We say, Father in heaven, hallowed be your name this morning. Let your great name be exalted. Let your great name be lifted on high. Let your great name be magnified. Let your great name be reverenced. We praise you, Lord. You deserve our praise, oh God. You deserve the honor this morning. You deserve the adoration. You deserve it, Lord. Let's lift up our voices and worship Him. Bless Him, praise Him. He deserves it. He deserves it. Yahweh, the self existent God, whom nobody created. You deserve you deserve praise. You deserve praise. You deserve praise. Kira baba baba shakata labo sika labo kura baba 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 baba. We worship that powerful name, that awesome name. We worship him. Ligado so pregede le ba kura basiya. We praise you, King Jesus, our Redeemer, our Savior, our Restorer, our Glory, the Lifter of our heads. We worship you this morning. We thank you, Holy Spirit, right here, right now. We submit to you, Spirit of God. Librado so bragada la bocia Thank Baba. Jehovah has marched ahead. He is fighting the battle. He has marched ahead. He is fighting every battle. We thank you this morning, Jehovah. Radus Kabalegadosia. Malegadoso Kontolo Bayanda. I bless your name, mighty warrior. Kurabashalabasia. We plead the blood of Jesus as we rank ourselves behind the mighty man of war. We are pleading the blood. Let the blood of Jesus speak over all of us. Blood of Jesus, speak over every family. Speak over every weakness, every limitation. In the name of Jesus. Father God, we just worship you this morning. You are mighty. You are awesome. King Jesus, I worship you, the head of the church. You are mighty. You are awesome. Lidada bosete lebosia. We rank ourselves under your great power. We humble ourselves under your great power. We can delebo shaka bayanda. We rank ourselves under your mighty hand. We plead the blood of Jesus and we rank ourselves in fire. Arriba sukatalabasia. Before you, great king, we are standing under your power, under your grace. Le braduskela mahanda. By the blood of the Lamb of God. Let every family represented here be sanctified, be cleansed, be purified. As we rank ourselves in your holy army with all the angelic hosts, with the angelic armies, we rank ourselves behind you, Lord. We rank ourselves behind the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. We don't seek to lead the battle because you have gone ahead Lord you are the one who goes out in battle we don't seek to ride ahead of you but we are riding behind the king of kings and the lord of lords the great army the great army of heaven we rank ourselves behind him Secondo lo bosse che le bossi andaraba. Masheke le katula maroko sokorobo. Mazuke tele bakura baba baba. Mezeke tele boria baba baba baba. Mezaka tolo bosha kabale gadosia. Mazoko dorobo kura baba baba baba. Regado sovrege dina danamo. Riamakuza malegado sufra dadabo seke leba. Mazuke lebo kura baba baba. He's the only almighty all powerful one. Regede zimrahande lebo sikatalabaya. No one can be compared to him. Livakuzeme. 
Kina Handa, Lemanina Mose Kendila Makuza Mahanda, Zembragado Supradadaba, Marogodoso Brege de Leba, Limbrado do Bredo Sukantele Bababa, Maria Gado Suvrada Bosia, Masuketele Bosica Talababa, Malege de Debosi and de Bocura Bababa, Mazondo Lolo Bredosia. We worship you, O oh God. We thank you, mighty Father. You are so great in battle. You are awesome, O oh God. You are awesome, Abba Father. Le brado so korea bababasia. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen and hallelujah. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. If we go to Revelation 19, Revelation 19, Revelation 19, I'm going to be reading from verse 11. Revelation 19 from verse 11. And I saw heaven opened and behold a white horse and he that sat upon the horse was called faithful and true. Those are his names, faithful and true, because he is faithful and he is true. He doesn't lie. Whatever he has said, that's what it is and it will come to pass. And in righteousness, he does judge and make war. His eyes are as a flame of fire and on his head are many crowns. And he has a name written that no man knew but himself. And he's clothed with a garment dipped in blood. And his name is called the word of God. And the armies which are in heaven followed him upon white horses, clothed in fine linen, white and clean. And out of his mouth goes a sharp sword that with it he should smite the nations and he should rule them with a rod of iron. And he treads the winepress of the fierceness of the wrath of Almighty God. And he has on his garment and on his thigh a name written, King of kings and Lord of lords. This morning, child of God, see the Lord Jesus in power, in glory, riding out. He's riding out ahead of you. Every battle that has been raging, the King of glory has ridden out in front of you with the angel armies. What is it that can stand in their way? What power can stand when the King of kings and the Lord of lords begins to ride out? Lift up your voice and honor him and thank him and say, I thank you, almighty Jesus, that you are riding in power. You and the angel armies. uh, Yes, Lord, uh, I thank you because you are faithful and you are true. That means that your word uh, can never be frustrated. Uh, Your word can never be frustrated. Uh, The Bible says uh, his name is faithful and true. Revelation 19, 11. He cannot let you down. He cannot disappoint you. He can only do the right thing because his name is faithful and true. Hallelujah. And in righteousness, uh, he wages war. The man of war, El Giboa, has ridden and out in front of you because he's the mighty warrior. He is great in battle. He has gone ahead. He's not asking you to lead the battle. He is not asking you to be the commander. He is asking you to rank yourself behind him and he has ridden out. The Bible says with the eyes which are like flames of fire, he is able to see what you can't see and he destroys the ordinances of wickedness. He destroys the evil gatherings and the conspiracies of darkness. His eyes are going to and fro the earth uh, with flames of fire, destroying uh, demonic pronouncements, uh, satanic decrees, uh, masukalabasia, generational cycles, uh, evil limitations, uh, satanic agendas, uh, and evil conspiracies. uh, He's gone ahead. uh, The Bible says, uh, Leke Sekeleba, he has many crowns. uh, He's above the principalities. uh, He's above the powers. uh, He's above uh, the the thrones. uh, He's above. uh, Oh, Reka Sandarabosia. Spiritual wickedness in high places. Uh, He's above all kings, all nations, all presidents. Uh, He's above uh, every evil power, every evil authority. He's above them. uh, They are under his feet this morning uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. uh, It says uh, in Revelation 19.13, uh, he is clothed with a garment dipped in blood. Uh, That is the blood he shed for you and I uh, by the blood.
blood of the Lamb. We overcome this morning. We overcome this morning. We overcome. We overcome sin. We overcome sin. We overcome satanic attacks. We overcome failure. We overcome frustration. We overcome limitations. We overcome by the blood. His name is called the Word of God. He is called the Word because in the beginning was the Word. And the Word was with God. And the same was with God from the beginning. His name is the Word. The Word is God Himself. The Word continually exists since the beginning. It exists eternally. He exists. He, the Word, is a personality. The Word is Jesus. Masokorobosia. Let the word become flesh right now in your midst. Let the word manifest in your life. He is the word. He is the word of God. He can create. He can recreate. Whatever is lacking in your life right now. Whatever needs creation. Whatever needs recreating. He is able. The word of God. He's riding out with the angel of is this morning on your behalf the Bible says the angel armies are following him on white horses and out of his mouth goes a sharp sword that he uses to judge and smite the nations begin to release the sword of the Lord on every demonic agenda on every satanic rebellion anything in your life that is rebelling against blessing we release the sword of the Lord anything rebelling against divine health we release the sword of the Lord, anything rebelling against the will of God for your life, we release the sword of the Lord. Anything resisting your greatness, anything resisting your greatness, resisting your deliverance, resisting your destiny, we release the sword of the Lord. With the power of Almighty God, the King of Kings, He has gone ahead of us. He is the mighty warrior. He is great in battle. Mazuka liga da se brada daba. Romba kusa balega da. Re masuka ndele bo kurra babasia. Mazinda labo si anda labo kurra basia. In the mighty name of Jesus, Jeke Telebosia, Marogodosi and Darabosia, Mazokondorobosia, Marogodosi and Derebokura Baba Baba, Mazukarabo Shalabosia, Mazukere de Bosia, Levrado Socondorobo Shalaba, Mizakan de Lebosia, Marocorobosi and Darabosia, Mizakarabosia, Masokoria Baba Baba, Jeke Lebo Sekendeleba, Undelema Ragadada Basekelebo, Marogodo do Barriga. Dasia mandele boria baba se kere bo shalaba lembrado socoria baba 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 regado socondo robo shalaba dabo mazuke tele boria gadasia in talabo si andala bo kurra baba baba in the mighty name of Jesus thank you Father thank you Jesus thank you Lord of Lords Hallelujah to the King of Kings Hallelujah to the mighty one of Israel Hallelujah to the one who is on the throne and who is marching out. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, rakase kerebosia. Makuza malagadasia. Mazunde de de bosia and de bosia. Makura baba baba. Nani nane ne mosia. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, mighty one of Israel. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. We want to go to the book of 2 Kings. Second Kings, Kurabasi and Rabosia, Rabosi and Rabo Kurabasia, Le Brado Socoria Marabosia. Second Kings, Chapter Eleven, Limbasute ne Mahanda. In Second Kings, Chapter Eleven, the Bible records the account of Ataliah. Ataliah is the daughter of Jezebel and Ahab. Some people say she's um, Jezebel's sister in law, but whatever the case, she's the daughter of Ahab and Jezebel. Where the witchcraft of Jezebel left off, Ataliah tried to finish it off. So Jezebel, Jezebel and Ahab were a power couple who were against the ways of God. They were a power couple inverted. They were causing trouble. And they taught the people of Israel how to sin and how to love witchcraft. 
And then Ataliah, their daughter, was married off to the king of Judah. And that marriage was strategic because it was meant to turn the people of Judah to idolatry. And remember, it is out of Judah that the Messiah was supposed to come. So by corrupting Israel and then corrupting Judah, it's a satanic agenda that says, look, the seed of the Messiah must not come. Ataliah's behavior was exactly like the behavior of Haman in the days of Queen Esther. When Haman tried to exterminate the Jews, the plan wasn't just to kill Mordecai. It was to make sure that Jesus will never come and humanity could never be rescued from the satanic agendas. But bless the Lord of my soul and all that is within me. Our God is wiser than Satan. I want you first of all, as we start to thank Jehovah, the mighty man of war, that every plot that had ever been designed against your divine destiny, against the destinies of your spouse, your children, your children's children, that the plots of Satan to cut short your destinies have been foiled by God because God sees and he already made a plan. And that's why yesterday we were, we were thanking God for Romans 8, 28, because all things work together for good for those who love God, who are called according to his purpose. Nothing can go wrong in your life. When the enemy comes in like a flood, the spirit of God shall raise a standard. The plots are destroyed and frustrated in the mighty name of Jesus. Radus Kabbalah, every plot that says you cannot be delivered, every plot that says you cannot be healed, that says you cannot be great. You cannot be what God ordained you to be. It is destroyed. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I thank you. By the blood of the Lamb of God, Jesus. All of us here, all things are working together for our good. We can never be destroyed. The destinies that you have given to us uh, will never be truncated uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, the plots uh, against our families, uh, against our bloodlines, uh, plots to cut off bloodlines, uh, to destroy marriages in bloodlines, uh, to say in this bloodline marriages are frustrated, uh, in this bloodline destinies are frustrated, uh, in this bloodline nobody can serve God, uh, in this bloodline they must die prematurely. We put the plots to an end. We put the plots to an end by the power in the name of Jesus and we declare everything is working together for our promotion, our lifting, our increase, our advancement, our healing, our deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Because the mighty man of war, El Giboa, has stepped out ahead of us in battle. You have never lost a battle, Lord. No matter how long it had been going on, Lord. Your power is greater. In a Destroy, O Lord, every plot of the enemy in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Second Kings 11. Second Kings 11 verse 1. You're never going to believe this. But the Bible says when Ataliah, the mother of Ahaziah, the king of Judah, saw that her son was dead, she arose and destroyed all the royal offspring. This grandmother killed all her grandchildren, except Joash, who was hidden by Ahaziah. She killed all her grandchildren. She thought she'd killed all of them for power. And you would, you would not believe this, but the Bible says a man's enemies shall be those of their own household. I want you to pray concerning the internal enemies, not even mentioning our neighbors and the people we met later on in life. But who is that man? Who is that woman in our bloodline? Who is trading in our destinies? Who is trading in the destinies of family members? Who is saying, at, at, because I want power, I'm going to use all of you as the price to pay for the power. You're going to raise up your voice and pray. Every spirit of Ataliah in my bloodlines from my father, 
father's side, my mother's side, my spouse's father's side is mother's side. I come against you in the name of Jesus. Every spirit that kills their own blood, that kills their own relatives, that contends against their own blood, they know your DNA, so they are trading in it. They know your DNA. They know the history of the family. They know the bloodline. They know the weaknesses of the bloodline, and they are using them to trade. Oh, Ribabu Zamahanda, Father, every power of Atalaya that has put us on the trading floors of Lucifer, we come against it in the name of Jesus. Anything that has put me, my spouse, my children, my children's children, my siblings, my brothers, my sisters, my parents, or their children, Lord God Almighty, anything that has put us on satanic trading floors and is trading with our destinies, Father, I come against it. I come against it. Marogodosia, Mazukelebasia, anybody who has put us on the trading floors of Lucifer to steal, to kill, to destroy, we come against it in the name of Jesus. Anything trading, virtue in our bloodlines, anything. This queen was willing to sacrifice her grandchildren. Father, in the name of Jesus, whatever in my bloodline is trying to sacrifice our glory, our honor, our promotion, our lifting, the ministries you've given to us, whatever is trying to sacrifice our children, our children's children, we come against it this morning. Every power that is trying to to, to, to sacrifice anyone here. We come against them in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, every relative that is trading in our names, trading in our stars, trading in our DNA, trading, oh God, in, in, in the talents and the giftings that God has given us. We come against it in the name of Jesus. We remove ourselves from satanic trading floors. We remove our DNA from satanic satanic trading floors. We remove our stars from satanic trading floors. Ramosia, our stars will not be traded with us. In the mighty name of Jesus, we repossess our stars. We repossess our DNA. We repossess our honor, our greatness. We repossess our wealth. Every wealth that have been put on satanic trading floors, we take it back. We take it back where they've traded our life and they're giving people sickness. Lord, we take back our life from satanic trading floors. We take back health from satanic trading floors. Marriages that have been traded, where marriages have been traded, have been put on satanic trading floors. We take them back. Where spouses have been put on satanic floors. Lord, we take them back. I take it back. In the mighty name of Jesus. I take it back, Lord. I take it back. Rabu Samahande. Ramu Samahande Rebo. Rabo Bobo Sutandalaba. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. We worship you today. We worship you today. Limbalu Gadosia. Makurabasia. Mazukerebo Kurabasia. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We'll come back to. Second Kings 11, but just put your finger on there. Let's go to Isaiah. Because the man of war is fighting the battle for us. Isaiah 42, Isaiah 42. The Bible says from verse 12, let them give glory to the Lord and declare his praise in the islands and the coastlands for the Lord will go forth like a warrior. He will stir up his zeal like a man of war. He's letting out a battle cry and he will shout out. Yes, he will raise a war cry. And he's already done that this morning. And he says he will prevail mightily against his enemies. Child of God, begin to declare this this morning. The Lord has gone forth like a warrior on my behalf, on behalf of my family, on behalf of my bloodlines, 
on behalf of my sisters, my brothers. Uh, the Lord has gone forth like a warrior. God has stirred up his zeal like a man of war. God is shouting out. Yes, he has raised a war cry. He is prevailing mightily against his enemies. Uh, the Lord has prevailed. The Lord has prevailed mightily, mightily, mightily against his enemies. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, like a man of war. God has marched out. Mezekerebosia, Mazukaradadabosia, in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. We worship you. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. He's out there. The Lord has gone out in the name of Jesus. Going back to 2 Kings 11, Joash was protected because Jehoshiba, the daughter of King Jehoram and the half sister of Ahaziah, took Joash, the son of Ahaziah, and hid him and his nurse in the bedroom. They hid him from Ataliah and he was not put to death. He was hidden with his nurse in the temple of the Lord for six years. While Ataliah reigned over the land, he was hidden for six years. And then in the seventh year, they brought him out. But when they brought him out, child of God, you will notice that it was the priests who stood around him with weapons. They took the weapons of David and his men. And they, they stood around this young king and they made sure that Ataliah couldn't harm him. And instead, Ataliah was killed. And when I read this, I could see the ways of God that you know what? Yes, in the family, we may have had Ataliahs who are trying to kill us. But the Lord has given us the Holy Spirit, our paraclete, who is helping us just like, you know, Joash was hidden. Yes. God has given us the Holy Spirit to be like Jehoiada, the priest. Jehoiada camped around this boy and made sure that this boy had the divine protection he needed and he couldn't be killed. And Jehoiada made sure that Ataliah was killed. I want you to receive from the Lord Almighty the angelic sentries around you, the angelic bodyguards that protect your family, your children, protect all of you so that that Ataliah cannot harm you in any way. The spirit of Ataliah cannot touch you. Instead, anyone who is an agent of that spirit, it is them who will lose their lives. God said, I have given Egypt as a ransom for you. I have given them in exchange for your life where they thought you are going to die. It is them who are going to die. It's not that you've killed them. It's because they took a vow and said over their dead bodies. Shall you be healed? Shall you be delivered? Shall you be married? Shall you be like this? And of course you are going to get married. Of course you are going to be healed. Of course you are going to break through. As soon as I break through, somebody has to die and it's not me. Because they said over their dead bodies, their dead bodies have to fall. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. Lord, I receive the angelic sentries, the angelic bodyguards. I receive divine protection in the mighty name of Jesus. I thank you for encamping around me, around my spouse, my children. Oh God, everything that concerns me, my profession, my promotion, everything, Lord. I receive protection over the ministry, over everything you have given to me. Over my brothers, my sisters, my parents, uh, everything I receive protection. Angelic centuries around us. Uh, we are divinely protected uh, from every attack uh, from the spirit of Ataliah, where they have vowed uh, and said over their dead bodies, uh, shall we be in peace? Uh, shall we rest in, oh God, in the blessings you have given us? Uh, Lord, uh, their own dead bodies will fall in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty God. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty God. In Jesus' name. Amen. Bible says to you, my sister, my brother, in Isaiah 43, from verse 2, he said, when you pass through the waters, I, Yahweh, will be with you. When you go through the rivers, they will not overwhelm you. When you walk through fire, you will not be scorched. 
nor will the flame burn you. He said, for I am the Lord Yahweh, your God, the Holy One of Israel, your Savior. He says, I've given Egypt to the Babylonians as your ransom. The Babylonians are asking for a payment and I've given them your enemy as the payment. He says, I've given them in exchange for you because you are precious in my sight. You are honored and I love you. I will give other men in return for you and other people in exchange for your life. I want you to thank God this morning that Father God, every altar that is asking for my life, you have given them their own priests and priestesses as their sacrifice. Yes, in the name of Jesus, it is them. They are the ransom. They are the ransom, not me. Any altar that is asking for my life, asking for my spouse, asking for my sons and daughters, asking for my brothers and my sisters, any altar asking for my parents, or anybody around me. Lord, uh, you have given their priests and priestesses uh, as their sacrifice, uh, not us. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, our DNA is removed uh, from satanic trading floors. Uh, our names are removed uh, from satanic trading floors. Uh, our ministries uh, are removed uh, from satanic trading floors. Uh, oh God, uh, our promotions uh, are removed uh, from satanic trading floors. Uh, wherever they are asking for us, uh, Lord, uh, you are giving the enemy in exchange for our lives. Uh, because you love us, oh God, we are precious in your sight. In the mighty name of Jesus, Jiva Kusa Baraba, Rebo Bobo Sokoria Baba, Mazune Nenemosia. Lord, I thank you for the exchange. I thank you for the exchange. I thank you for the exchange. We will live. We will not die. We will not be disgraced. We are honored. We are not the tail. We are the head. We are above and not beneath. We will lend to many nations. We are not borrowers. In the mighty name of Jesus, the blessing of the Lord uh, which maketh rich and add no sorrow is upon us in the name of Jesus. Thank you Father in Jesus mighty name. Hallelujah. Thank you Father. This morning, child of God, I want you to see yourself that you've been plugged into that power source. That dunamis is flowing. That exousia is flowing. The authority that cannot be silenced. And as you lift up your voice, power is flowing and doing what it's going to do in your life and in your bloodline. In the mighty name of Jesus. Power of God flow in this place. Power Power of God flow over every family represented here. Power flow, power flow, power flow. Zamali hande, urabu zamahanda, rebo bobosia, di dandura masia, dubaku zabalaba. Destroy the works of the enemy in the name of Jesus. Karabo se kerebo sha. Hallelujah to the King of glory, the mighty, all powerful, all wise God who has never lost a battle. Our story will not be different. Our story will not be different because he is the God of signs and wonders and we receive and we thank him. So shall it be in Jesus name. Amen and amen. My heart, you know, Psalm 23, the Bible says in verse five, you prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You have anointed and refreshed my head with oil. My cup runs over. We need to pray that as God has prepared the table before us, no satanic agenda can remove that table from us. You know, the enemy cannot steal the table that has been prepared because that table carries everything. It carries our, our deliverance, our healing, our prosperity, our joy, our peace. The table that God presents for us has everything. Whatever we need is on that table. So let us begin to come against any power because this is why the power of Emmanuel is flowing to destroy the works of the devil. Every work of the devil that wants to destroy what has been prepared for us by on the table of the Lord. We come against you in the name of Jesus. We come against the powers of darkness. We come against the witchcraft powers. We come against the warlocks. We come against 
against the gatherings and evil conspiracies uh, from the pit of hell. Uh, anything assigned against uh, the table God has prepared for us, uh, we come against you in Jesus' name. Uh, we bind your power. For whatsoever we bind on earth uh, is bound in heaven. It's already bound in heaven. We bind your power. We bind the satanic robbers. We bind the anti-testimony spirits. Uh, we bind uh, those who want us to labor in vain. Who want us to labor in vain. Who want to eat from our table. We bind your power in the mighty name of Jesus. We will never labor in vain. Our portion will not be taken away. Our portion will not be taken away. We are not going back. We are not regressing. We are not going backwards. We are not losing what God has blessed us with. In the mighty name of Jesus. Sheke le bradosia, marogodo socoria baba 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 baba, li bradoso condoro bo shalabasia, mazu kerere bo kura babasia, mezende de bo shalabasia, masu karabosi andala bo kura baba baba, jikatula barobo si andala bo sia, masu kentele bo si andala bo kura basia, maso condoro bo shaka balegada, inamuza manemo si andala bo kura bahan. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, we thank you for cancelling the works of the enemy. Thank you, mighty God that you've gone ahead of us in the man of war, El Giboa. You have fought the battle for us in the mighty name of Jesus. And Father, we just want to secure every blessing. We secure every blessing by the power of the blood of the Lamb of God, Jesus. And the power in the name of Jesus. We secure, Lord, every breakthrough. Father God, the healing testimonies we secure in the name of Jesus. The deliverance testimonies we secure in the name of Jesus. The financial breakthroughs we secure in the name of Jesus. The promotions, the increase, the enlargement we secure in the name of Jesus. Father God, whatever you have blessed us with, we declare it secured in the precious name of the Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your name forever. In Jesus' name, amen.